It was a gruesome attack on a firefighter just trying to do his job. In April, deputies say an out of control crash victim bit a Polk County fire chief, ripping all the skin off his forearm. The accused attacker wanted a judge to help him get out of jail. News Channel Ace Melissa Marino is live in Barta with his story. And uh, in this case, the judge just didn't budge. Yeah, that's right. He would not reduce his bond amount, especially after hearing from the victim, the fire chief, who will have these injuries for his life. This cell phone video shows the terrifying attack, like a scene from a horror movie that was unfortunately all too real for Polk Fire Rescue Battalion Chief Kevin Shireman. Well, as he was being tased, uh, the augment driver uh, became erratic, moved his head, and then somehow got a hold of my arm. And started biting my arm. The man had just crashed his car through a fence in Winter Haven. As deputies and other first responders tried to get 26 year old Briansky Gardner under control, he bit Shireman's arm again. This time he latched on. The pain started to kick in, and you know, I'm like, hey, stop biting me, stop biting, you know, and probably punching him in the face, trying to get him to let go. The attack so vicious, so gruesome. Shireman had all of the skin from his elbow to his wrist ripped off. His skin was completely gone. Kevin's wife, Angel, says his recovery has been agonizing. He has had three surgeries. He had 63 staples in his arm. He had a skin graft. He's been in physical therapy for six weeks. They extended it six more weeks. He um, is possibly going to have to have one more surgery. And now they have a new fight. Family and colleagues showing up in numbers to get their message out, trying to keep his attacker behind bars. You know, it's not just what he did to Kevin, but if he can do that to a public service officer, what is he going to do to the community? Well, Gardner's bond will remain at $229,000. As for Shireman, he plans to return back to his post as chief. It is going to take some time. He has a long road of recovery ahead. Jen? Melissa Marino, Live Force in Polk County tonight. Thanks, Melissa.